It's a build day. Uh, we got Kyle coming out. We got Austin showing up with the tractor in like an hour. We got Nico uh, smelling things while he has a bone in his mouth. He's probably just smelling the bone from the wind blowing the smell into his mouth. Uh, Neil's bike is still cut in half. My bike, the clutch is impossible to pull. Uh, Cowie's working. Uh, yeah, I don't Yeah, it's gonna be a good day, baby. Ooh. <laughs> I don't think we've really done a maintenance pass on the bike, uh, period. <laughs> Alright, so this is Kyle's first time out here. Absolutely ripping, absolutely ripping it. Oh, I put this here yesterday. <laughs> that section kind of sucks. That's the sketchiest part of the track. <laughs> we tried to go up it a few times and that's why it sucks. But <sighs> we're about halfway. So how you doing? Fine, but it doesn't really shift out of first gear. Oh shoot. Uh <laughs> we can switch bikes if you want. Fine. Okay, well, I guess we'll keep going. Oh man. <laughs> oh shit, that is new. Okay, I didn't used to do that. Uh, here. I feel bad. You ride this bike. Because I think you're going to have a lot of fun. Uh, of course I stopped in the stupidest spot. All right, we're switching bikes. 
that thing's gonna electric start. You're gonna love it. Um, yeah, bitch. I've got, these are steel toes, so I just brute force that. <laughs> You're wearing at knees or whatever, so I can't imagine that was fun. That bike's perfect. That bike's like new and crispy. <laughs> I'm gonna hit my knees so many times on this bike. thorn bushes so uh
that's a lap. On the big bikes, it's uh, more fun. But that bottom section, that's like the dopest we have. And this bike, you can tear it up. On the big bikes, you feel like a professional. Just like, you can go wide on around both the turns. Uh, I don't know, I feel like this bike is like the perfect bike for this. It kind of is actually, like, I didn't want to admit that, but typically Neil and I will do like five or six laps on the 250s and then somebody's like, oh, I guess I'll ride the 140 and you just end up ripping that for like another hour. You know what the mileage is for that thing? <sighs> no. <laughs> I estimate it's about like a nine minute lap. Eight minutes if you're really feeling it. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Do you have an estimate in your head? <laughs> no. Yeah, well, end of the day, you might have a better idea. Like, it's, uh, you can tell what Neil and I did by hand or with a shovel, and then you can tell the stuff that Austin created. Uh, and then we have an enduro cross, I'll show you that. That thing is stupid, but. <laughs> it's on some logs somewhere. Yeah, we, there's a lot out here. We just kind of like set it up a section. That's the official enduro cross area. So this is it. A lot of uh, mishaps in this area. Um, this one messes you up uh, particularly a lot. Neil's gone over it on this. Uh, I don't really know how, but uh, yeah, this is this one definitely like first few times we hit it, it was just you just close your eyes, damn near. Um. <laughs> That's so sick. <laughs> That's uh, that was fun. That was probably an intro to something. Dude, was the, was the trees falling over? No, I, well I cut down a bunch yesterday. Or it cut. was so windy last night. Yeah, I don't know. It was, it was okay. It was uh... The ground's kind of frozen. It was frozen a little bit, yeah. yeah. But uh... It'll like... It'll thaw. That's nice. good, actually, yeah. Oh boy. Well, that's a lap around uh... <laughs> our track. It definitely isn't a great track, but it's how we, I feel like that's why I'm decent at dirt biking. <laughs>